We've been driving for hours, but it is totally worth it because I have just arrived at the house of my sponsored child. She's called Valencia and it's a real privilege to be here and I cannot wait to meet her. Sasa? Nice to meet you. I'm very excited to be here today. Would you like to show me? Show me around, show me where you live. Valencia has been telling me about the job she does around the house and it's things I would never even think of. Even though she has to think about these things every single day and that every day is a struggle, she still has hopes and dreams. In the UK, we take education for granted. Some kids will say in the morning, I don't want to go to school. But that's exactly what Valencia wants to do. She dreams of being a teacher, and because her school fees are now paid for through sponsorship, her dream can become a reality. But it's not just Valencia that benefits from having a sponsor. Through compassion, her family have learnt how to make bricks and have since built their own house. But the thing that stood out the most for me is that through the Compassion Project and the local church, Valencia's family have learnt that God loves them. In a situation that would leave many feeling desperate, Compassion have enabled this family to have hope. Children shouldn't be held back from living their dreams just because they live in poverty. Wow, what to say about that. I, I just feel so overwhelmed to have come here and to have been welcomed. I expected to maybe be given a handshake, but to be welcomed by Valencia's mother with a hug, it was, it was just so wonderful to be hugged and greeted in that way. Um, to be able to share with the family was really precious and to be able to promise that I'm going to pray for and support that child is, wow. With a compassion sponsor, each child is free to be who God made them to be.